we are an international leading company. Uh, um, uh, it seems that we are the number one touristic group in the world uh, in number of uh, customers, in number of uh, euros uh, turnover that we make. Uh, we have uh, more than 30 million customers coming from uh, 25, it's 25, there are 25 source markets. Now today we have 27 source markets because we have uh, started some activities also in Russia uh, and in China. Um, we have more than 200 products, we have more than 200 brands. Uh, so don't ask me to tell you all the brands now, I will not be able to tell you everything because it's such a big company and I don't overview it myself. We have, and that's specific for big groups, you will find the same structure in Thomas Cook, uh, which is also a big integrated group, we have our own aircrafts. Um, uh, we have 155 own aircrafts in different fleets uh, in uh, UK, in Germany, in Belgium, in Holland, in France. We have aircrafts also in the Nordics. We have also aircrafts flying from TUI in Canada. Uh, and we have more than 50,000 colleagues. So um, um, don't ask me all the names of the 50,000 colleagues. I will not be able to tell you. Um, the strategy is we say uh, we want making travel experience special, and that is something which is important. We don't sell holidays, we sell a travel experience. Uh, that's much more than just say, selling a holiday. And uh, we, uh, of course, since we uh, have capital, have, have money from shareholders, we have to create shareholders' value in order to make our company attractive, since we are public listed we need to be attractive on the stock exchange in order to have people wanting to buy our share. Uh, we, okay, product and content, we need products, we need content of those products. Uh, we need to sell these products, so we need brands and we need distribution channels. Uh, we have people, we need people to, to make all this. We need operational, and we call that operational efficiency, because you can have operations which are very expensive, but the best is to have operations which are efficient and uh, who, which are cost efficient also. And, uh, okay, we need growth uh, because uh, a group like TUI Travel is focusing on volume. We are customer obsessed, we want value, uh, we play to win, and uh, we want responsible leadership. What is uh, that responsible leadership? Well, you can say that it's linked closely to the corporate social responsibility that we have in a group. That means uh, environment, uh, that means uh, respect for local culture, for local economy, making sure that people working in, our, in the industry, uh, in our partners, companies, are uh, people working legally, having some uh, salary and all these things, no children at work and things like this. So, what are the unique selling points of a group like Dewey Travel? We say we are a leading tour operator uh, group with powerful brands. Um, uh, we differentiate our contact, content uh, that uh, no other tour operator can easily match. That means that we try to give a content to our products, uh, which is also uh, typical for Dewey Travel. If you want more explanation, you can ask me later. Uh, we have uh, specialist niche offers. Uh, we, have, uh, we are number one in water-based holidays, cruising, to is very strong in cruising. Uh, we are number one in Arctic and Antarctic uh, expeditions. And uh, we have uh, a very important activity in a family uh, and activity-based holiday clubs. Now, when I heard this morning what was said that traditional families were disappearing, uh, I think we are working on that as well, but that we can discuss later on. Uh, conclusion, uh, we, we are a, a big company, but I will not explain you what is on the slide that you can read. Uh, the, the, the big uh, philosophy of TUI Travel is that they have kept the philosophy of the tour operators which are part of the group. There is no, no one dictating from the top that everyone has to think on the same level and in the same way. It is important because the different markets in Europe are different. We are working with different mentalities of people. We are working with different needs. And uh, who the best placed people to know what the needs are, are the people active in those markets. So they keep their identity. There is still freedom to, uh, to act, but with one uh, same strategy at the end is to have a differentiated holiday experience and a shareholder's value.